Yo, your hey, J. Mario Thomas, kicking it with Celebs by TV, of course. facilities and like just the club aura because obviously Arsenal is a bigger club more competitions more games and obviously when you go down the levels it's still competitive but it's like the bigger clubs have a lot more to play for and obviously every team lower down's dream is to play in the Premier League against teams like Arsenal and stuff like that so it's just uh, getting to terms with the differences in the playing types really At the time, from the players that I was probably playing before I left, I would have probably said Cesc Fabregas because obviously his capability of like finding strikers and creating chances and as playing a striker myself, that would probably be the best asset for me to have playing behind me as a striker. Oh, that's a difficult one because obviously I signed for Arsenal when I was seven years old. But obviously as a child you don't really notice what you're getting into until you get to the older later stages so it's then when i reached about 16 when i signed my first pro contract i realized that i was actually in this football game for real so i had to up my game and up my level to try and make the best of my opportunity so i would probably say maybe about 15 16 when i noticed that everything was was it more serious than what I thought it was? I'm 23 now. Well, obviously, a lot of people's targets will be to like play in the Premier League and playing the Champions League and stuff like that. But as a player myself, I've already, I've already done an experience that at Arsenal. I've played against Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. I've played in Champions League in Russia um, against uh, CSK in Moscow. I've, I've done those things, but my, my ultimate goal is to actually get into the Premier League and stay in there like for a duration of time over oh, years and years and years and obviously end my career at the highest level possible. So it's on track and obviously as still only being 23, I've still got a lot of years to go so I'm just hoping to progress as fast as I can and get to where I want to be. where I don't see him as often because obviously he plays for Tottenham when I'm here in Bristol. We normally meet up in the off season when we're in Miami and have a good time. Chinese food. Italian guilt. disturbing some of the stuff that he comes out with and obviously for me being a friend of his and getting to see stuff that's coming and coming out soon I can see what's, what's going to be coming to shop with the people out there right now. So 
That's me, J Man Thomas here with SelectSpyTV.com. You've had enough of me. Stop spying. Get out of my house.